Landlocked between massive lands of India and China, Nepal spans over 147,141 square kilometers with three parallel ecological zones running east to west, the Terai, the hills and the mountains. Due to topographical constraints, only about 20% of the total area is under cultivation, albeit agriculture occupies a predominant position in the Nepalese economy, with about 90% of the population depending on it. Nepal has three categories of rivers, the largest river systems originating from the multiple tributaries flowing from the high Himalayas. These tributaries are diverted at most places to aid in irrigation. Notwithstanding this, inadequate provision of irrigation has been identified as one of the reasons for poor performance in agriculture. Since time immemorial, farmer-managed irrigation systems have played a major role in the irrigated agriculture of Nepal. One measure of effort to address the shortcoming of the existing practice of irrigation is the introduction of a water-propelled water pump called the Barsha pump. Also called a spiral pump, this emission-free machine is now being promoted and implemented across Nepal. This undertaking is being shouldered by practical action under Securing Water for Food SWFF program in partnership with Akista and financial support of USAID, SIDA, Ministry of Foreign Affairs and the Netherlands. The Bersha pump has proven to be an effective support to the livelihood of communities sans facility of irrigation and where operating cost for fuel and maintenance cross the financial capacity of farmers. Being relatively more sustainable and cost-effective, it does not require any fuel or electricity to operate and the maintenance cost is virtually zero. No need to say that farmers are now saving 70% of the irrigation cost with the use of this technology. <laughs> The project that began with the installation of the first pump in June 2014 by Akista at Indrawati River in Sindhupalchuk district has now pervaded to 17 districts in all five development regions of Nepal. Being mindful of environmental concerns, practical action aims to help people in all districts of Nepal enhance food security with this technology. To achieve this, efforts will be made to create access to irrigation at places without the facility and at places where use of expensive diesel pumps add financial burden on farmers. Involvement of the state could certainly help not only in installing bursha pumps in remote and geographically challenged areas of the country as well, but also uplifting the living standard of people of those places. Ah,